Hello, everyone inside the Global Freedom Movement. My name is Andrea Chalmers, and today we're going to dive into the tax savings of getting started with this business. Now, whether you are looking for a product just for health purposes or looking to start a business and create some passive income, this video is for you. I'm going to show you how anybody can leverage tax savings. So whether you yourself have a job and an income coming in, are self-employed, or you have a partner that is working in has an income tax or has income coming in, you can leverage this video and new tax savings significantly. And if you stick around to the very end, I'm going to show you how each and every single one of you can get your products for free. Yes, for free. So stick around. We're going to dive into some very powerful information here. So how much money are you losing in income taxes each year by not owning a business? Some of you may know this or you may not know what your number is right now, but we're going to find out. So brace yourself. There's a reason why they don't teach us about tax savings in school. And yet when we dive into this today, you guys are going to learn some stuff that you can unlearn. So once you watch this video, you can never go back in time and unsee this. So if you are not prepared to significantly change your life financially and take full control of that of that side of your life, turn this video off because once you see it, you cannot unsee it and there's you're going to want to take action immediately after watching this video. So if you are not prepared for it, if you want to stick to the old way of learning about going to work, paying your taxes to the government, this video is not for you. If you're for supporting the government with uh, 25 plus percent of your paycheck, this video is not for you. If you want to get your money back, legally get your money back, this video is for you. Let's continue on. So let's find out how much you pay each year in income taxes. There's two ways you can easily do this. You can go to your year end pay stub. So the last paycheck of the year, you'll see the total amount of what you've paid in taxes, or you can easily just go to a website that can do the calculator for you. So I know there's people from all around the world that inside this business, but we're going to focus on Canada and the United States and, um, and then basically just on Canada. So you can get a generalized idea. Canada is where I am from and where I know taxes the best. Again, I am not an accountant. I have not taken an accounting course. I, so I'm just going off of information. I have learned from my amazing accountant and from the financial books that I have read about about how to create wealth and all of that. So uh, I am not an accountant, but we're going to go through the numbers and the numbers don't lie. So we are going to take a look at British Columbia is where I'm from. So based off of a 50K a year income, we're just going to take a general income here. Um, that means if you're making 50K a year, that means you're making about $25 an hour. So on the website that I showed you for Canada, you can go and pick your own number. So if you're making more than 50K or more than $25 an hour, your taxes are going to be significantly higher than the formula that I'm going to show you guys today. So the, the more money you make, the more you need a business to get your money back right so we're just gonna go with 50k a year 25 dollars an hour i feel like that is a very general normal amount of money that the average person makes so the average person is paying twelve thousand seven hundred and seventy dollars in taxes each and every year so that's 25 percent of your hard-earned cash is going directly to the government government wouldn't it be nice to get some of that money back well let's dive into that um before we do though i just want to show you guys really quickly on the united states side the average of what the same amount 50k a year 25 dollars an hour they're look they're paying about $9,591, about almost 20, 19.18% of their income taxes every single year um, to the government. So again, Canada and the United States are very, very similar when it comes to taxes. Also with Australia. Now we're just gonna focus on Canada side of things. I just want to give you guys a general idea that relatively similar in um income taxes. So Who's ready to learn how to easily, and I, when I say easily, I mean easily get your money back. So 
in British Columbia, Canada, based on that 50K a year income, if you had an online business, say you got started with a Nagic and you started with a trifecta. Trifecta is the ultimate way to get started with the business the way I started and so many others. Um, you know, if you have seen the trifecta and you're like, well, that's a lot of money. It isn't, it isn't for, and I'm going to show you right now. So if we take a look on the right hand of the screen, these are basic expensive, personal expenses that you yourself are already paying for just living your daily life. So today we're going to do use a formula of 20%. So we're going to use a 20% formula for personal expenses and how you can turn those into business expenses. So a business expense becomes a write-off. Now, if you do understand business or you do have a business, you can, you know, 20% is relatively low. Um, you can write up up to 100% off of certain things, but I wanted to keep this as realistic as possible um, and as basic as possible so that every single person watching this understands how they can get their product for free and how they can get their tax money back. So we're just going to quickly go over the basics that any single person just by having one of these products allows them to write off in taxes, your rent or your mortgage, your property taxes, your house insurance, your car payment, your car insurance, your fuel, electricity, internet, cell phone. Um, if you have other basic expenses, anything to run your home or anything like that, can also go into your basic expenses. Some people pay for water, some people pay for gas, all of those things. Again, keeping it incredibly, incredibly basic. All of those totaled up. You can see the numbers here. Yours might vary, but this is a formula any one of you can use to find out exactly what your what your personal number would be. But I put down $37,200. Now, on the basic expenses, if we're using the formula of 20%, writing off 20% of all of that, at $7,440 that you can write off. Now, here's where it gets really exciting is when you start with a trifecta, um, or if you just start with a K8 or whatever, that is 100% write-off. Marketing, all of that kind of stuff, and we're going to dive into that in a minute here, is all 100% tax write-off. So yes, there is an initial investment, but yes, you will get it back. So when we take the total of your basic income, basic expenses and your trifecta, and we total that together, that's $16,300 that is... Uh, tax deductible, you are able to go and apply that to that 50k that you make a year and offset that tax. So let's see what that looks like. So on the left hand side was your salary of $50,000 a year, where you're paying $12,770 to income taxes. Now, when we go and create our tax write-offs, your salary then drops down to $33,700, um, putting your tax total at $8,299. So if you don't understand how taxes work, every single two weeks or month, however you get paid out, your tax money goes into what's called a, a withholding account. And then at the end of the year, when you go and file your taxes, that money either drops into the government's bank account or it drops it back into yours. So if you have tax write-offs, you get some of that money back. So the money that you would get back at the end of the year just by getting started and only using the basic tax write-offs is $4,471 in tax savings back in your pocket. That's already half of your trifecta in the first year of having this business. Okay, exciting. <laughs> So what other stuff can you write off? Well, when you have a business like we do, a lot. Uh, if you can see in the pictures here, you can write off any type of office supplies, your computer, uh, GoPros, um, travel. If you're taking your Kangen water machine with you on, on a travel ex uh, experience, your full travel is written off. Your flights, your hotel, your 
any like expenses is all paid for. Um, for us, if you guys have been following our journey, we fought, we drove from Canada and we moved all the way to Cabo San Lucas. We brought our machine with us. Our entire trip is a complete tax write off. And because we leverage Facebook ads and uh, to generate leads, having people come to us that are interested about the water and the business, having people come to us by running ads, we're allowed to write off things like going to Disneyland and having fun experiences like that because we put pic use pictures like that or content from going to Disneyland uh, inside of our ads. So that's a full tax write off as well. Anything to do with marketing is a tax write-off. So there's so many avenues. If you can see Brent and Molly over here, they have a travel trailer that they have been traveling around in Australia for over a year. They have a little deco on their travel trailer for their business. And now that makes their travel trailer a write-off. So there's the possibilities are endless for tax write-offs. So what you saw in the last... Uh, the last slide where the basic tax write-off, that's just the basic stuff that you are already paying for um, that you can be getting your money back. But there's so much more. And yes, you want to be cautious to an extent of how what kind of stuff you can write off. But if you are genuinely using um, your experiences and um, and anything like that for your business, you can write it off. There's not an issue at all. If you have a really good accountant, if you're in Canada, we have a great accountant that specializes with Enagic and digital marketing businesses that will help you maximize how much money you can get back. It's worth it at the end of the day when you have a business like this. Do not waste your time trying to do the taxes yourself. Allow the professionals to do it so you can do it right and get a ton of money back. So... Here's where every single person needs to sit down and every single person that can think of any single person that would want these products or want this business needs to pay attention. Your products are fully paid for with the money you would have paid in taxes. So how is that possible? Even if you never wanted to do this business, you just wanted the machine for the health purposes, you wanted the Inespa so that you can use the shower system for your skin, the Ucon supplements, um, any of them, any and all of them, you have three years. And this is the rule of thumb. I don't know all around the world, but can the CRA in Canada and the IRS allow you to claim losses on your business for three years. So what does that mean? That means that you still reap the reward of tax write-offs for three full years, even if you never wanted to refer this water to anyone, but wanted this machine solely for you and your family's health benefits. So if we go back to the slide here, where you have your tax write-offs here. The only difference would be then that your tax write-offs each year would be solely based off of your basic tax savings. Now, every single year, you're not going to be buying a trifecta, but the average number for those three years is about $3,300 you would get back in tax savings. Well, your trifecta is only $8,600. So that means that not only are you getting your product for free, you're actually getting extra money back in your taxes. Should you only ever use the basic um, expenses? Now, even if you'd never wanted to sell the machine and you wanted to leverage all these additionals, you... Um, vacations and all of that, you brought your machine with you. The government doesn't know the difference between you trying to build a business and you just leveraging tax write-offs, right? Um, so you have three years to really maximize getting your money back. Now, at the end of the day, I always encourage people, this water is amazing. It's life-changing. I recommend every single person to share this water with the ones that you love, family, friends, people that are ha that have health conditions. The water is not a cure for anything, but it is a significant uh, piece of the puzzle to our health. Our bodies are 70% water. We all know this now from watching the, the last two videos. Our bodies are 70% water. That means water is 70% of the health puzzle. So if you are wanting to significantly, significantly change your future, 
and really start looking at your finances in a different avenue, having an online business is the way to go. Now you know the secret of the wealthy. You cannot afford to, to not start a business. If you pick up any book from any wealthy person that's sharing how they got rich, they did not get rich by having a nine to five. They got rich by learning the loopholes of taxes because as long as you're a slave to taxes, you will always be a slave to the system and you will always be supporting the government. So my question for you is, um, we'll just disregard that one slide there. Are you ready to be able to support yourself instead of supporting the government? Are you ready to put your tax money back into your pocket? Or are you going to continue supporting the government and allowing them to spend, 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 spend? If you have been following politics for any sort of period of time or through the pandemic, Canada, the United States, Australia, all around the world, governments are spending carelessly and are in significant amount of debt. Taxes are not going anywhere. They're only going to keep going up. And if you don't find a way to offset taxes, income taxes, you will never, ever get a Head. This is the simple, the simplest and easiest way to create um, more money back into your pocket to keep what's yours. And more importantly, allow you to create a passive income that can significantly change you, your family's life and anyone who you share this business opportunity with and this tax savings video with. We need to take full control of our wealth. That is, there's no... Um, there's no reason why we shouldn't. The wealthiest people in the world all do this and it's completely legal. It's something that every single person should have as a tool in their back pocket so that they can be able to create a life of whatever they want to for themselves. This is edu financial education that every single person needs to see, hear, and share because we are in a significant time in this world right now where people are in such financially hardship spaces that any information like this can significantly change somebody's life and allow them to take full control and alleviate so much stress that the pandemic has caused on the world. So share this video, share this with your friends, share the water. This opportunity is absolutely life-changing. And thank you so much for taking the time to check this video out.